What's up guys? We fix that and start LSP FR. So follow these steps. If you have Steam for Steam users, because I ain't got it at the game, so Steam users, you wanna go to you're gonna look for your main game directory, alright? You go to here and then go to your hard drive, program files, Steam. Scroll down till you see Steam Apps, and then Common. Then go to, don't press it yet. You go here, hold on. Go here and pin to quick access. What that does, and then when you enter it, it'll show up right here, grab the file file. Let's say you go here, then it'll go straight to here. All right, we got that out the way. Let's go ahead and install this. You're gonna have to get that too. Shit. Download. Alright, so you wanna go to your Google. Go to LSPDFR. No, don't go to LSPDFR. Go to. I'm sorry guys, LSPD first response. When you click that, click lspfr.com. I'll send the link, link will be in the description. Oh shit, what the fuck is this? I don't know what this is, man. Hold on. You go to your website and then you go on click LSPDFR, whatever version you're in. All right, go to download. You can read all this if you want. Go to green download. Do never do setup because it's updated. Do never do setup, always do manual install. So you want to go manual install. Do this, download, and then it'll go right here, download, I'm not going to show all the mods I have on those PFR, but um, Cause that'll take a while. That's gonna be about five hours if I show how to install my mods on there. But when you go here, you want to go to your main game directory, and you want right click on File Explorer and go to and go File Explorer, and they won't pop up here. Now, if you use WinRAR, go highlight it, just one click, and then right click it, open with WinRAR. If you don't know how to install WinRAR, link could be in the description though. So when you go to the the link, look over here, the RAR download. Oh wait, no, not this, not this. I'm sorry, guys. Download. Hold on. Keep going on the wrong shit. I'm sorry, guys. Um, I think it's right here. Yep. Do not. Well, if you want to, you could do it. Download. And then it will install right there. Okay. All right. Alright, so you want to go to, I mean, you could open it with your Fog Sport, but I rec highly recommend you open with WinRAR. You will see all this, right? Let me show you real quick. You want to go all of these, all of these, right? You want to highlight them, 
accept license and and the readme all right and you want to drag drag and drop over here it'll show it right you just drag and drop over here and then what you want to do when you see rage plugin hook right here you want to press it hold on i'm fixing to show you it'll go to an okay sign i recommend put this on 60,000 so it won't crash so your shit won't crash this is only on pc so you do that on 60,000 now this is your now if you do not do this it's rather you could like whatever mod you want to put in there do that or you could just do load all plugins we'll start up now this is for the people that have crash issues like your game crash and it won't start whatever you want to check this force window mode you want to check that and then And then go to backup game version. You want to back that up. It'll take a, a while. Make sure. Hold on. Make sure you do that. And your game be supported. It'll show it right there. And then you want to press save. Save and. Sorry I can't talk to you. Save and launch. You want to do save and launch. And then it'll launch the game and stuff. Uh, now to install WonderWare, you just click on it. Hold on, I can't really show you. You'll just click on it and press install, and then it'll show up. And then when you it shows up on your desktop, here I'm gonna show you. When it shows up on your desktop, go here and go to. Hold on, highlight it. You y'all know what I'm trying. Pin the taskbar. When you click that, and then it'll show up right here. Now, now when you want to, now if you don't feel like going to your, like all the way to your main game directory, you want to highlight it, and then. Pin the taskbar somewhere. Yeah, it'll say pin the taskbar. If you want, I'll pin it. It'll say that. All right. Then that's about it. I think. Hold on, real quick. And then I'll put this link in the description too. If you want to do the um, mods in here and stuff, there's cool mods over here. I'll put the link in there as it will. And then if you go back to the LSPDFR page, LSP, LSPDFR.com, right? Hold on. You want to go here. If you not click on whatever this is. Go to downloads. Then this shit will pop up. Hold on. If that pops up, just back out like that. Alright. Go to downloads. And then you see the scripts, plugins, vehicle models. Like you could press these, download them. Now, if you want to install the. Like LSPFR models and stuff, you won't have to. I'll put the link in the description. You're gonna to have to have Open IV, right? Open IV is where you install your GTA 5 mods, OSPFR mods, whatever, right? So you wanna go here, download, and then here I'm gonna show y'all. We'll go here, close out that. And then you want to go downloads. 
and then you won't press that. You go your language or whatever. Click that. I accept. You can read it if you want. Make sure this is checked. Then continue. Install. It'll take a minute. And then close it. And then you're going to have this on your desktop. Open IV. Go to GTA 5 Windows. Now, you want to go here. Click Browse. Y'all know how I showed you. Windows. Program Files. Steam. Steam Apps. And then Common. Don't click none notes. Just select folder, then press continue. Continue. Then it'll take a while. If it... Now, to you gonna have to have app mode on to do the mods. You'll have a mod folder and everything, whatever. You go to tools and go to ASI manager. Make sure all of these are installed. It'll say you gotta install all three of these. And then you could go to edit mode right here. You could turn it off and turn it on, whatever. That's how you install that. So I hope you, this helped you. And peace out.